They work or? It's just like eating for both of us to start. Oh, oh, oh. It's changed. Weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing. Alex, you might need some headphones. An English poet. Oh. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. But the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. But you could take some amazing shots. Those beach whales are so sad. I kind of know how they feel. Um, At least, you might be able to, but... I'm alive here with you. Well, You're a real survivor, Chloe. Right I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you... Remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. Can I mute myself? I my back snap and... Skype, but not mute you. That was the last thing I ever felt in my body. Um... Well, then when you I woke up in the hospital, I literally... Yeah, unless, unless, you, unless you choose, Jesus. like, push to talk or something. Um, which I, you could do. I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. Which means you, you would have to hold the button when you I'm talk. Just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. What, what missing girl? I don't know her name. I just read about it in the news. I feel bad for her family. This is... Such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. Don't say that. I'm not trying to bum you out. It just seems like Arcadia Bay is having a meltdown. I know things seem out of control, but as long as we're together, there's a storm of I ruin. I feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. That was wrong. You're my best friend. Oh, Max. <laughs> thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? <laughs> I hate that word. No offense. None taken. Say something so I know I can hear you. Hi. Can you hear me? Okay. So I can hear you with the headphones on, I guess. Just a little yeah, weirder. Sure. <laughs> I'm 
mentally recapping in my head because it's been a while. That girl Rachel's dead, or she's still missing in this timeline. Rachel's missing. I don't even remember who Rachel. Oh, the girl who like killed herself. Yeah, you like never meet her. You never wait. wait you never met her. No, 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 no. Rachel wasn't the girl that killed herself. There was that girl that was missing from the get-go that you never met. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. This is alone. like longer than Zelda with their Sometimes I look like a total life. teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive, but when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. Time to explore. But you're still amazing. Never. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh... <clears throat> it's a little weird walking around this game I haven't played in so long. Uh, can you can you bring me some water? Was it always third person? Yeah, you always saw her. <laughs> like it's only when she does the like time flip that you then see her hand and she's like doing that little shaky thing. But it's always third person, I guess. Uh huh. Because you saw what she looked like, you know. It was always kind of like yeah. you're like this little hover right I should offer her to put head. makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but <laughs> I should offer it would be fine. I should put makeup on. Aww. And, uh... Do her nails. Bracelet. Look, water. Yeah, look at the mouth control joystick. There's the old Chloe. Max, it is so cool that you're here again. I'm glad you think so. That is so incredible. And she can browse cat videos on the web. Chloe is still a punk at heart. But she can't stage dive anymore. That's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Well, she could technically still stage dive. Just like, uh, like, a, like a tosser. Let me get back to you while you're something on back to you. I'm trying to think what did we you know we went back further than normal, so what did we change that We changed the dad that got that died in the accident, but oh, instead he did. she I still can't believe I put accident, Chloe in that chair. Oh, or maybe you can't uh, take without giving. Now, whose father was it? Was it? It was Chloe's Chloe. father that we saved. Because yeah. oh, he had to like in a, instead. I think he had to take the bus. Snow globes are taking over. But I don't know how she got in the car then. Let me get this poor girl or what? Oh, the at. snow doe. <laughs> I guess not everything changed. Hello, Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. So then does Chloe even know that she has this gift? If she went back in time and didn't talk to her, apparently? Drink up, Buttercup. Oh, man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. <laughs> I'm a Ouch. pod in a cast. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But 
We're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. You have me. I'm not leaving you, Chloe. Well, you didn't visit me a lot either. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No excuses, I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not Supermax. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. Are they okay? Can they pay all the bills? <sighs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. Like tears in sweet the rain. To chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> What do you want to watch? Uh...